as you all probably know, the estimates of how much plastic there is in the oceans from fishing and fishing industry and fishing equipment. They say that it's, uh, the estimate is 60% of the plastic in the ocean is from fishing equipment, fishing nets and stuff like that. So, one easy way to get rid of, uh, no, not to get rid of that plastic, but get rid of more contribution of that plastic is just to stop e eating um, sea animals, sea creatures, sea beings. So if you stop eating animals from the ocean, then you will just reduce the amount of plastic enormously in the ocean. And other places too, because it, it all will go on onto the beaches and stuff like that. And if you eat that, you will also eat plastic because like if you don't want to go on a beach with plastic that is like everywhere here, there's plastic in the water, imagine that you're eating living beings living in the water where, where there's plastic everywhere. They might eat some of it. They find whales with a lot of plastic inside. Imagine the smaller fish, they will just like, they breathe through that water. They have, the, they have plastic everywhere and you just eat that plastic. So if you want to eat plastic, eat more fish and animal products. Because also, you know what they do? They take these, like some of the fish that they cannot sell, they make them into feed, like animal fodder, like food for other animals. So these other animals are eating the, these fish that are filled with plastic and then the plastic goes into those other land animals and those land animals you then eat afterwards. So you get just plastic, accumulation of plastic in, into your body. So just eat more animal products and you just get like a ton of plastic inside you. Like scientists now find that they, they can measure plastic in your blood. So I think the safest way to get more plastic into your body is to eat animal products. Just keep doing that and maybe at some point we will, the people will get so sick that we will reduce the amount of humans on the planet. That will be like beneficial for the planet I guess. This is the best place a fishing boat can be. Parked at the harbor. Those are the best examples. The fish factory route and the cemetery route from Rayong City to the beach. It's a killer man. Killer. Fish sauce factory. So the only place you can get like semi-cool water is going into the ocean right now. All water in Rayong is super hot. From the tap, it's super hot. Let's have a look. If you want to snorkel, you need to find a um, place with quiet water. On the other side, the wind is going inside, so you cannot really snorkel on the other side because there's like too much turbulence and water and bl bl blurry, blurry water. But on the other side of a like stone settlement, you can just uh, snorkel here because the water should be ah, clear. I mean, they have dragons underwater here in Thailand. Fresh air or semi fresh air. I, th I think I still can smell the fish sauce factory. No heavy cars allowed on the bridge.